guys, it's your girl T, and I have a crazy story that's coming from my first favorite state, Ratchet Ass Florida. So what's going on now, Florida, you ask? What's going on is that we have this crazy ass case. It's about a 49-year-old woman. Her name is Cassandra Rasmussen, and she's from Crestview, Florida. She decided to go to Walmart the other day. She took her dog, Waldo, with her. And while she was shopping at Walmart, she left her dog in the car for over 13 hours. And the only thing she did to provide this dog any type of comfort is that she left the window cracked open. She didn't have any food in the car. She didn't have any water in the car. And the dog was only discovered after somebody walked past the car and they seen the dog in there dead. So when the police went up to her and they asked Cassandra, they're like, you know, what's going on? Do you know that your dog is out there? And she's like, yeah, I know my dog is out there. I just decided to run up in the Walmart. I just need to buy a few things. Well, after searching the video camera, they discovered that this woman had been sitting in Walmart for 13 hours. And in those 13 hours that she sat her ass in Walmart, she never once came back outside to check on the dog, to see what was going on, feed the dog, nothing. So, I mean, this story to me makes absolutely no sense. One, who the hell shops anywhere for 13 hours? If you're doing something for 13 hours and you're not getting paid for it, I'm going to need you to reevaluate your life. I mean, is it that damn serious? I understand a lot of Walmarts in the South are open 24 hours a day. As much as I hate going to Walmart, you can't get me to be in there for longer than an hour at the most. Usually, I'm in there for 10, 15 minutes and I run back out. I could imagine just sitting around in Walmart, walking around, not doing shit for 13 hours, and the whole time she knew her dog was out there in the car. You know, so this whole situation is just really, really disturbing. I keep telling you I couldn't make this shit up if y'all paid me. I mean, this whole situation makes no damn sense. I feel real bad for the dog. This woman needs to be in jail. She needs to be arrested. This is no different than leaving a child in the car. The dog can't fend for himself. He can't, you know, open the car door. He can't crack the window down any further. The dog basically died of dehydration and you know overheating it must have been a horrible death for this dog and I feel bad for the person who discovered the dog you know so I just think the whole situation is just insane that a dog sat in a car and died because a woman was in Walmart shopping for 13 damn hours anyways go ahead and leave a comment let me know your thoughts on this entire crazy situation that's coming from our first favorite state ratchet ass Florida all right deuces